Good evening, everyone. We have already concluded our presentation and recognitions of our new firefighters, so we're moving right into public forum. If anyone would like to address the board, they may do so at this time. Anyone? All right. Well, you must not be running for office. Was it a year ago? It was. Okay. Trustee comments? See, Andrew, anything? Happy Halloween. That's pretty much it. Don't forget to come on Saturday night for the Jack and Lantern Walk. Mm -hmm. Seven o'clock. Yep. This whole place will be decorated. So. Yes. Yeah, full of kids. It's a lot yeah. of fun if you haven't been here. And free candy. Free candy for all. I'm good. Really? Thankfully. How's your leg? Hurts. Okay. Thanks. Moving on then, fiscal officer, Ken. Thank you. Uh, sounds like a broken record every month, but the uh, financial reports indicate that our uh, revenues are coming in better than expected, 5% or so. Uh, that changes because of the way the, the revenues do come in. Expenditures are under budget, and we hope that we can keep that there until the end of the year. The most important financial reports that we have are going to be at the end of the year, just to see how we do. So, um, we have no appropriation changes, and I think we have several minutes to be approved. I guess the first four, no, we'll do the first four together. Yeah. We'll group together, and then the last one in October. So, I move to approve the minutes of August 16, 2018, September 6, 2018, September 10, 2018, and September 20, 2018. Second. Mrs. Stone? Yes. Mr. Pappas? Yes. Mr. Berth? Yes. And then the October 1st? I move to approve the minutes for October, to October 1st, 2018. Second. Mrs. Stone? Yes. Mr. Pappas? Abstain. Mr. Berth? Yes. Thank you. Thanks, Ken. Margaret? Uh, Margaret is working on a, no. another resolution at the moment. <laughs> she was downstairs. Um, yes, she, <laughs> she, was, was, she had oh, to step sorry. away. Yeah. So the document that she has prepared is a resolution that would authorize me to execute all of the documents related to uh, closing of the, the land that the board is selling to the Marison Company on Nagel Road. So I would ask for the board's consideration of this resolution. I move to adopt a resolution authorizing the township administrator to execute and deliver all documents required in connection with the closing of the of transaction contemplated <coughs> by the purchase and sale agreement pertaining to the disposition of real property described here in pursuant to section 505.10 a6 of the revised code. Second. Mrs. Stone? Yes. Mr. Pappas? Yes. Mr. Berg? Abstain. Thank you. Okay. Paul? Uh, we have one item before you tonight. It's a resolution for your consideration um, for sidewalks along Beachmont Avenue. As you know, ODOT does not permit sidewalks in there right away unless the local jurisdiction takes responsibility for them. So we, this came about, um, well this has been in place for quite some time and the trustees have passed resolutions for other portions of Beachmont but we're asking for your consideration between Nagel and Nordyke. There are two new developments in that particular area that will be constructing sidewalks and we realize that the resolution that's currently in place does not uh, take into effect that portion of Beachmont. So there's a resolution before you. I move to adopt a resolution authorizing the Board of Trustees to agree to cooperate with the Ohio Department of Transportation. Second. Mrs. Stone? Yes. Mr. Pappas? Yes. Mr. Gerd? Yes. Thank you. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Lieutenant Guy. The uh, only item I have on the agenda for the board's consideration this evening is a liquor license request. I feel like we've done this one. Uh, we did do this. I thought, thought the same. Really <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, we did it's do this. another license. They've never been in there, so I they don't know. I'm not a big nail person. Maybe it's a different one. I'm sorry, Molly. Like 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 request for top nails enterprise. It's the address change. Oh. Oh, because they moved from there over to there. Yeah. 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 Thanks, Molly. 
Top Nails Enterprises Incorporated, which is top nail salon and spa at 7428 Beachmont Avenue. Um, our department has no objections to the physical location. Uh, I move not to object to a new liquor license request for Top Nails Enterprises, Inc., DBA Top Nails Salon and Spa, located at 7428 Beachmont Avenue. Second. Mr. Stone? Yes. Mr. Pappas? Uh, yes. Mr. Girth? Yes. yes. Thank you. Thank you. Eric, you're up. All right, before you tonight, we have a resolution declaring an emergency for snow removal on an accepted road in the township. I, yeah, I move to adopt a resolution declaring an emergency for snow, snow removal on unaccepted roads. He's Second. Mr. Stone? Se yes. Mr. Pappas? Yes. Mr. Gertz? Yes. I'm not looking at him. All right. Secondly, uh, I have a memorandum before you to hire temporary seasonal workers for the Public Works Department to, uh, to help us get through these, the 2018-2019 uh, snow season. I'd like to hire two people. Oh, okay. Two guys. I move to authorize an amount not to exceed $40,000 from Road and Bridge Fund for seasonal temporary employees for the Public Works Department from January 1st, 2019 through December 31st, 2019. Second. Mr. Stone? Yes. Mr. Yes. Mr. Gertz? Yes. And lastly, on uh, Wednesday, September 19th, the Public Works Department competed in the Hampton County Snow Rodeo. Uh, myself, Rob Rose, Larry Dotson, Keith Heilman, and Becky Campbell were all judges. Uh, Jamie Bender, Harley Crewley, Jeff Tucker, and Don Tilly all competed in the snowplow rodeo. And our, uh, our one and only Harley Crewley finished third out of 59 competitors. Oh, so yeah. Oh. And he also came in third in the backhoe competition. So he had, wow. he had a good day. And that is a, it's a great training tool. Um, We've done that for years, and we would all like to thank you for letting us do that. And hopefully, we we'll continue to do that for years to come. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. We have video of that. I know. Congratulations. Yeah, right. It was on the news, actually. Was we've, it? We've liked this ground so How do we do that. usually? Is this a good year or better than usual? We usually do pretty well in that. Um, Harley and Jamie usually finish towards the top. They're usually in the top ten, no matter where they go. That's cool. They you know, usually do a good job. A lot of fun. It's a good day. And part of the course is avoiding mailboxes along the way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, so if you see mailboxes, damn it's not organized. Thank That's you. That's all I have. Thank you. Thanks, Eric. <clears throat> Chief Martin. Uh, first, I have a, a resolution authorizing the purchase of DSO software. Okay, what is that? Should be 10 8. The project is going to be 10 8. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. 610B. 10A. I don't have a I don't either. I don't think you have I moved to. Here it is. Okay. Ah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I moved to adopt a resolution authorizing the execution of an agreement with ESO Solutions, Inc. Second. Mr. Stone? Yes. Mr. Pappas? Yes. Mr. Girth? Yes. Thank you. Uh, the second item um, before the board's a resolution for the purchase. Oh, sorry, I'm sorry, reading the wrong one. Uh, resolution for the purchase of equipment, materials, supplies, and services through a joint purchasing agreement program. Uh, that's GCH. I move to ad adopt a resolution authorizing the purchase of equipment, materials, supplies, and services through an intergovernmental purchasing cooperative pursuant to authority of section 9.48 of the Ohio Revised Code and authorizing the township administrator to enter into an agreement with said cooperative on behalf of the township as a participating public agency. Second. Mrs. Stone? Yes. Mr. Pappas? Yes. Mr. Burke? Yes. Excellent. Thanks, Chief. Vicki, Steve? Uh, yeah, Mr. Steve, the first couple of items. I do, thank you. Good evening. Um, for the last 14 years, we've been uh, fortunate to have the services of Nancy Kane to assist us as our communications consultant. We don't have a communications coordinator or a public information officer, so Nancy serves in that role. Um, each year, we request the board consider that annual contract, and I do have a motion before you to amend last year's resolution, 1711-16-09, uh, to extend uh, Nancy's continuing, continuing consultant role 
uh, beginning October 29th of this year, continuing through December 31st of next year, 2019, at a total expense now to exceed $40,000. If there's any questions, I have any So moved. Second. Mr. Stone? Yes. Mr. Babbins? Yes. Mr. Gerth? Yes. And the second item, um, arising from executive session, this relates to potential property acquisition. Uh, as, as discussed with the board, I uh, would request authorization to uh, acquire said property in an amount not to exceed $45,000. Uh, that would include due diligence and any necessary site work and demolition expenses that might be incurred if we were successful in obtaining the property um, that is uh, potentially to be acquired. So moved. Second. Mrs. Stone? Yes. Mr. Pappas? Yes. Mr. Gerth? Yes. And then Ms. Parker has another item arising from exec session. I believe you each have a memo and a motion. This is discussing salary adjustments for non-collective bargaining full-time and part-time staff members. I'd like to point out that in the past, all of these adjustments are driven by annual performance and performance reviews. The amount we're requesting that we would distribute is in keeping with the amounts that we have used in the past. So we're getting extraordinary this yep. year. If you have any questions, I'd be happy to retain those. Otherwise, I would ask for that authorization. So I move to approve the 2019 compensation adjustments as presented. Second. Mr. Stone? Yes. Mr. Pappas? Yes. Mr. Gerth? Yes. And that's all we have for the board this evening. Very good. Next meeting will not be in this room. It will be in the other room, November 15th. November, yes, 15th. And with that, I move to adjourn. That Second. Could, could be a record. Mr. Stone? Yes. Mr. Babbitt? Yes. Mr. Yes. Yes.